I just did that, didn't I? I don't know. I hit a whistle accidentally and whistles are happening. But guys, welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back to our arc survival ascended. Where, boy, oh boy, has it been a week? I've got a lot to update you on, I think. Uh, it's been it's been an interesting one. I was actually meant to... What are you doing? Can you just all come back out here, please? I think I whistled Jay. I don't even know what just happened. But uh, I was meant to record this video like three days ago. I got to the office at about 8.30 Monday morning and uh, I sat down to record. In fact, I prepared some things, got it all ready, made sure everything was in order. And I hit that record button and then I got a phone call from my wife. She said, hey, can you be at the hospital in about 30 minutes? And uh, so I, I was like, oh, uh, can you just wait? I've got to play some arc. And she's like, no, I can't wait. We're about to have a baby. So yeah, I, uh, <laughs> well, I had a baby uh, a few days ago, uh, a little, another daughter, another daughter. So, uh, yeah, if uploads have been a little all over the place, which I know they have, uh, apologies for that. I've been a little tied up elsewhere and you know, if things are a little bit weird over the, the coming week or two, that is why. Um, yeah, I'll pop up a little photo for you guys. This is my little, this is my, little, my these are my children. This is my family now. Um, everything is great. Everybody's recovering. Everybody's doing fantastically. And um, everybody just got home from the hospital. So I'm here uh, playing Ark again. And then I'm going to go back home and spend some time with my children. But uh, yeah, thanks everybody for hanging in there. Thanks for your patience. Today, today we're going to do some pretty cool stuff. Before we do, if you do enjoy the video, please go ahead and I still can't do a proper thumbs up, but punch that thumbs up. We can rain those thumbs ups. Now, let me show you where we're at. Uh, that's my T-Rex. Oh my goodness, I had a hard tech. <laughs> I was like, why is there an electric T-Rex munching his way over there? <gasps> Did I whistle? With... I whistled with everyone aggressive, didn't I? Is that what I... I bet you that's what I did. Hold on a second. Uh, how do I find out? You said to a great... Yeah, every... that's what I did. I'm so dumb. Uh, no, not passive flee, just neutral. And then everyone over here. I whistled aggressive. I was gonna say this doesn't look like the J whistle that I'd normally know. Um, yeah, that, that explains a lot. Everybody get back in the base, will you? What are you doing? You're just all over the shop. Now, last episode, we tamed up Shadow Turkey. Uh, I got two of them now. Uh, we got a second one. It's great, it's fantastic. <laughs> What is this mess in front of me right now, man? I gotta organize these guys. Um, just, just chill, everybody. My goodness. All right, you guys are nuts today. Uh, on top of that, we got us a fabled gerbil. That's right, our first. Wait, mythic, not fabled. Fabled is from primal fear. This is primal chaos. Um, we got a mythic gerbil. He's pretty cool. Very, very low level. Uh, but the hope was that he would lay me eggs. Now, last I checked, he has not laid us eggs. However. We do have a lot of other eggs at our disposal now. Uh, in fact, we've got two shadow eggs, a lot of beta eggs, a lot of hydro eggs, not a lot of alpha eggs for some reason. We've got an overwrapped egg. Um, yeah, like I said, lots of hydro eggs. The other ones are a little bit lacking as well. But the good news here is we have shadow eggs. Only two of them, uh, but that's going to allow us to get, hopefully, two more mythic kibble. Um, mythic kibble, I think. We should be able to get two of these. Two mythic gibble, which means we could potentially tame up some more mythic dinosaurs. And I've got something in mind that I want to go targeting. I, I, I'm pretty sure we've got everything we need to make this happen. Um, can you guys leave me more eggs, please? Oh, and we got more, um, we obviously got more shadow kibble too, in case we can find some more shadow dinosaurs to tame up. Now, um, as I was looking at the mods today, I was looked like it was having a, an issue with the dragon mod that we had like broken files or something. I don't really know what was causing it, but I get the feeling uh, that I no longer have dragons in this world. I just wanted to check that really quickly because um, that would suck. Ooh, what are they called again? Yeah, I don't think we've got dragons. I think they all despawned, which means whiplash is rip. Uh, good, good thing though, I guess, is we still got a pteranodon that we tamed up <laughs> the other day. What are you, are you guys still aggressive? Just. Just neutral. Just take it easy, guys. Take it easy. It's all good. Um, we got a pteranodon somewhere around here. That fire pteranodon that we got. Does he still exist? Or is that mod also gone and, um, you know, deleted itself? Um, my goodness. How do we do this again? Search for... Ter no. Wait, what? Where'd my fire pteranodon... We did tame that fire pteranodon. Did we get it killed? I didn't think we did. Oh man, that's really upsetting. 
Um, hold on. What am I doing here? What about, yeah, Whiplash is definitely gone as well. No, Whiplash still exists. Yo, Whiplash. We still got our dragon. I was wrong. All right, fantastic. Good. We still got a flyer. That's fantastic because, uh, yeah, obviously, we're going to go find some fabled dinosaurs to tame up. Now, we need egg layers. I need fabled eggs so we can finally get our hands on some demonic dinos. That's the whole point of this whole thing. We want them demonic dinos, um, which means we got a few things to choose from. We can either fly around, look for some fabled friends, um, like, not that, that's just a, that's just a dodo. Very interesting colored dodo. Um, we could go look around for some fabled dinosaurs, or I can pop open my little searcher and we can, uh, you know, have a little, have a little look. Did I say fabled again, by the way? I meant mythic. Now, we don't have any Ankies last I checked. We got no frogs. There's a few Brontos around. Also, we're aiming low level, obviously, because I want to tame... Well, if we can get our hands on two things, that'd be the best. That way we can get eggs. Uh, Pteranodons, though, I feel... Ooh, both females, too. Um, ooh, you know what? A level 40 and a 140? This is good. I think we're going to go look for some Pteranodons. Uh, I'm going to start by going over to old Herbivore Island. I believe that... Yep. Over at Herbivore Island. 100%. Let's go and pay it a visit. See how many kibble it needs. See if we've got enough for a level 140. The beauty is I don't really have many flies, which is really unusual because usually I'm like just, you know, my head with flies. Usually we just got flies coming out of our butt. This series, we just, I don't know, just haven't really had many flies, I suppose. Um, this is a good opportunity. One, because I need flies. Two, I need eggs from these flies. We can tick two kill two birds with one stone. Tick two boxes with a single tick. I don't know any other analogies, but you get the idea. This is a double win, and we need to bag this. If I can get two pteranodons, we'll probably get some mythic eggs really quick as well. Because, I mean, as far as egg laying goes, pteranodons are pretty good at that. I just don't know if the egg laying rates on these is based on... That looks... All right, so, so that little dragon still exists. That's good. Uh, yeah, I don't know if the egg laying rates are based... Oh, dude. <laughs> uh, that is a max level. This guy's been here from the start, hasn't he? I think I remember this guy from when we came over this island back on like episode two. Um, or four. Episode four, I think it was. Either ways, 45 kid would have tamed that thing up. That's nuts. Then you got this guy. Oh, two kibble. No way. Um, okay. And then we got this guy. Five kibble. I'm not going to get a stego. Especially not a male. They're not going to let me eggs. So I guess this is my guy. Uh, we can knock it out. Oh, it's going to be tough. I'm not going to be able to knock this out instantly. We are... Oh, I'm just trying to think. I can't... I'm pretty sure you can't bowl a mythic dinosaurs either. So, actually, headshots. Headshots affects these guys. Yes. Okay. So if I can strike this guy in the head with one of my mythic darts... I think we might be able to make this work. We should be able to make this work. I just need him to come land. This is this is good. This this might be good. This should be good. Touch wood. There's a lot of room for error. We might mess this up completely. But I need to get a headshot, basically. If I miss a headshot, he's going to fly away, probably into the ocean, and it's going to make this really hard for us. So that would be bad. But at the same time, I'm kind of at his disposal on when he wants to come down. So, come on, buddy. Surely those wings of yours are getting quite tired. Getting a little bit heavy. A little bit sluggish. I know you want to rest them. Come on, come on, come and rest them on the ground. Come on, come down here. Come down here. I know you want to. I know you want to. You won't regret it, I promise. I'll take good care of you. Like I do all my tames. I definitely do not get my teams killed. I don't know who would have told you that. That is not true at all. Come on, buddy. He's like <laughs> flying over to the other side of the island. Man, I can't even see because the grass on this map is so darn long. All right, come on. I've always wondered why the grass can be so long in this game. It just makes it so hard to traverse. All right. You're really not making this easy for me, are you? Lucky we're on Herbivore Island and it's pretty safe out here. Unless we accidentally shoot a Bronto, which I did last time I was here. 
That's right. We died on Herbivore Island. Pretty embarrassing. But... You know what? I was going to take a shot. I was going to take a shot. I just don't... If we miss its head, we're in trouble. And now we've got a Bronto on the way. He's coming down. He's coming down. He's coming down. Finally. Finally. That is why I didn't want to take the shot earlier. <laughs> I missed it. Gotcha. It's enough. It's enough, baby. There we go. Here is your kibble. You're going to eat it nice and fast. Or should I give you some? Yep, there we go. One down. One to go. And just like that, we've got ourselves our basic surrounded on. <laughs> What's with your head? You hurt your neck there or something, buddy. Nice. Um, all right. Now we got to go get whiplash. <laughs> I really should have brought a Tyranodon saddle out here with us, but... Well, I don't even know if I got one anymore. Since my fire Tyranodon that I'm pretty sure I had my saddle on... Well, I think it disappeared? My fire Tyranodon? I don't even know. Maybe maybe I got it killed and I can't remember. Oh, wait. No, did it die? I think it did die now that I think about it. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, buddy. You have to come and sit next to me. All right, sit tight. We're going to teleport home together. And then I want eggs out of you, like, as soon as possible. Okay? Because, I, I don't know. My turkeys... My turkeys don't seem to be laying my eggs very quickly. And I need, I need quicker eggs. There we go. Sorry about the mess. My dinosaurs decided to run them up today. I didn't... I don't know. I didn't... I, well, I guess they kind of listened to my order. It was an accident. It was a mess. It was a disaster. But it is what it is. Now, can I craft up a Tyranodon saddle? We can. I was a little bit unsure if we had the kind to make that happen, but thankfully we do. And just like this, we have ourselves a saddled up mythic Tyranodon. All right, let's see what you can do, buddy. Let's see what you can do. For one, it seems pretty quick, so that's a good start. Two, damage. I mean, not bad. You're only a level, uh, level 209. Not bad. Oh, there's a headshot. Dude, seriously, for a flyer, it's not terrible. Not terrible at all. I don't think it's got any special abilities. It can, you know, pick things up. It's a Tyranodon. Of course it can do that. Um, can't fight things while picking them up. Can, you know, swipe things for four and a half thousand damage. That's actually pretty good. Uh, outside of that, though. Don't dismount. Wow. I even saved it, and then I still managed to double dismount. That was pretty terrible. But we did it. We got a mythic. I really wish they it only was going to require one kibble. But I guess it wasn't meant to be. So. <laughs> I need to do some healing now. Uh, but hey, if you want to like lay me an egg straight away. Not to say I'm going to. Did you do a poo or did you lay it? Yeah, it was a poo. <laughs> oh, you got my hopes up there. Not to say I'd go straight and get a demonic dinosaur right there second. But I could. I could. Not that I would, but I could. Yo! We're in luck! We're in luck! We've got another Shadow Egg! Kibble! Uh, Mythic Kibble! One Mythic Kibble! Let's go! <laughs> All right. I reckon this might be able to get us. We might be able to get that other Mythic Tyranodon. Uh, it's only a low level. Level 40. That can't be more than one Kibble. If a level 140 was two Kibble... A level 40? Come on. It's got to be only one kibble. Over to the green obelisk. I'm pretty sure this thing was like right next to it. Double mythics. Essentially coming right up. Let's try not to sacrifice one to get the other. It wouldn't be the first time I've done something like that. But let's go. All right. Where are you? I know you're out here somewhere. There you are. <gasps> it's on the ground. It's on the ground. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I really should check my surroundings just to make sure there's nothing dangerous out here. I didn't even have to hit this thing with a headshot. But I'm going to anyways. No, I'm not going to miss it completely. Oh, come on. Please, please, please. Got you that time. Oh, yes. And I left the keyboard base. What is wrong with me? All right, hold on. <laughs> uh, one second. One second. I need to go get my kibble because apparently I'm too stupid to actually pick it up out of the workbench to uh get it okay up off of you get our booties on in here Joe boy mate let me some eggs please 
I don't actually know if they... I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure gerboys don't lay eggs, but I don't even know if you can breed... And Is there any point in me even having that gerbil now that I think about it? Um... Yeah, I mean, he, he looks cool and he jumps really high. So I think I think that's reason enough to have a gerbil, if you ask me. Now, what has been fighting this guy? That's kind of concerning. But I guess it's not really my problem right this second. Because I have myself a second Mythic Pteranodon with another weird neck for some reason. The only downside in these guys is that uh, it would have been nice to have a male and a female. A male and a female. At least they would have like mate boosted each other. And then we might have got eggs a little quicker. I don't know. I really have no idea. But hey, we got two. We got two. Hopefully that means eggs twice as fast. But you know, there's never, there's never any certainty. You just never really know how things are going to go in that sense. You know? Anyways. Well, guys, I know it's been a short one, but I have uh, a fresh little baby I'm going to run home to. So thank you so much for watching. We've got our mythic tames. Now I just need to sit, let them cook me up some eggs. And uh, hopefully we'll have our hands potentially on some kibble very soon. Some demonic kibble. And eventually some demonic dinosaurs. But I guess we'll just have to wait and see what happens. Thank you so much, guys. I'll catch you in the next one very, very soon. But until then, keep smiling. Have a fantastic day. Bye for now.